The Batman reportedly revealing footage at DC Fandom, same with the Suicide Squad, and I'm gonna explain to you how you can tune into Fandom. Hello, hello, I'm Chris Killian, and I'm sorry, but I couldn't think of an opening line today. You had one job to do! It's being reported that Matt Reeves will be in attendance at the Batman panel at DC Fandom and will be revealing some brand new footage. At this point in time, we don't know if it will be a teaser trailer or simply more test footage, but I will literally settle for anything as long as I don't have to show this test footage when referring to the Batman ever again. I can't do this anymore, man. Seeing as how they've got seven weeks shot in the can and quarantine has given them plenty of time to make something snappy, I think we'll get to see something cool. Am I right or am I right or am I right? James Gunn and some of the cast of the Suicide Squad also revealed that we're gonna get a sneak peek of the film and find out who's who. So that's another panel you might not wanna miss out on, especially if you wanna know what supervillains John Cena and Pete Davidson are playing. Yep, I said Pete Davidson. No! No! Speaking of DC Fandom, I got a lot of messages last week about how can you tune in, so I'm gonna break it down real quick for you right here. All you have to do is head over to the official DC Fandom schedule and create an account. Then you can browse through the entire 24 schedule, pick out any of the panels you're into, and then save it so you'll be notified when each one starts and where they'll be broadcasting. Well, that was easy. Not that I needed Kevin Smith to tell me that Tony Todd would be amazing as Scareglow, but it's still nice and refreshing to know that Kevin Smith is so excited about Masters of the Universe Revelation and how good he thinks Tony Todd is as Scareglow. Look, I know that wasn't much in the way of news, but for us to be friends, you need to understand and respect that I'm gonna bring up He-Man any chance I get. Finally, according to producer and writer Dean Lorry, Harley Quinn still hasn't been greenlit for a third season by HBO Max. What are you waiting for, huh? What are you waiting for? Seriously, it's the best new show and fits in perfectly with HBO, so you guys need to quit dragging your feet. Luckily, there is a Harley Quinn Q&A panel at Fandom, and considering will there be a third season is gonna be like the first question anyone asks, here's hoping they get it greenlit this week and we hear about it soon. That's enough to get your week on the right track. You guys make sure you follow me on Instagram at CK Comedy, if nothing more than as a giant middle finger to BD. Until tomorrow, stay safe, wash your hands, and thanks for coming to comicbook.com for the best geek news. Hello, hello, if you liked the video, make sure you give it a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel, and turn them notifications on because we're bringing you the best geek news Monday through Friday at 11.30 Eastern Time. If you didn't like the video, why are you still watching this? I would have stopped watching forever ago. Go on, get out of here. Go find something you like.